One of the most boring single documents that you've ever read is the HR manual that you get when you come into a business or the code of ethics that you get when you get to school. And the reason it's so boring is because you know all this stuff. It's pretty obvious. And that's not where ethics is interesting. That's not where ethics gets complicated. See, the problem with ethics is we think of it like a pristine marble statue. We think it's one of these ethereal, pristine, never changing things, and right is right, and wrong is wrong, and that's it. And because of that, we've polarized a lot of debate. We've ended up being absolutely certain that we are right, and they are wrong, and if they disagree with us, then they must be you know, fundamentally evil, because obviously we're right. The question that I want you to consider, and the place where ethics really gets interesting and comes alive, is what happens if right and wrong changes over time? So imagine that what's right today is 180 degrees wrong tomorrow. And there's three things that I really want to convey to you. The first is that technology fundamentally changes ethics. The second is that technology is exponential. And the third is that ethics may change at exponential rates. And that has a series of implications for you, for your descendants, for how your descendants judge you, for how your business operates, and how your business is regarded today and in the future.